guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. I thought it would be super fun to play some more Animal Crossing and just kind of show you my typical day in the game. I've just loaded in. Isabel's already greeted us, um, and that's pretty much all I've done. So I did change my character's outfit, though. But um, yeah, we'll go ahead and get started here. So let's see. I do want to check my mail, of course. And just one letter from Eric. It says, question for you, Wonderbud. You know the way the sun goes away and everything gets real dark and boring. Well, how about if everything didn't need to get real dark and boring? Think about it. <laughs> Aw. Okay, let's see what he sent us. It's probably a light is my guess. Some kind of light. Um, yeah, it's a candle, so cool. Nice. Uh, it does look like Lobo's exercising back here. I want to go chat with him just because he's new. I do wish he was in his home, but we'll have to wait on that still. I still haven't seen him inside of his house. Let's see how he's doing, though. Hey, yeah, how are you doing? What's the latest? All right, so what to do now? Day's getting away from me. Oh. <laughs> oh, hey, kiddo, what's on your mind? I just realized we'll hear from the Happy Home Academy tomorrow. Why do I feel like they're not gonna like what I've done with my place? Oh. <laughs> okay, so he's hanging out, doing some exercises. So what I like to do in the morning is definitely get my DIY on the beach. So we'll go ahead down and do that. Also need to buy some candy because you have to buy your piece of candy every day. Um, so we'll do that as well. But I also want to check for seashells to clean up the beach too, so we'll just start and make our way through. Most of the time though, my DIY is something I already know, so <laughs> yeah, I'm not ever too optimistic nowadays, but we'll still get it. So yeah, just a bunch of seashells. It's probably on the other side of the island, I'm wondering. So we'll just gather these. And since it's Saturday, KK Slider is here, so there's nothing extra we can do. Um, oh, a purple mom. Awesome. And there's a fossil up there. But yeah, so I've been really wanting red to come back. I need to get some more paintings. I have a good amount in my, um, in my museum, but definitely need to get some more. Because I don't fast travel. I actually didn't say that in my tour, but I don't really fast travel. I did fast travel a little bit to get my rocks um, where I wanted them to be, because that was a little bit of a headache. But other than that, I have not fast traveled, so I just like to play the game kind of how it's supposed to be played. Uh, but let's go and gather that. Let's see what we got. A uh, bamboo candle holder. I know I already have that, so... <laughs> oh well, we'll go ahead and finish off this last little bit and pick up any shells. Okay, now that we've got all our shells, we'll go ahead and head up here. I do have some fossils from yesterday, so I'm gonna have a lot to assess. I really do want to just bury some fossils in my little dig spot, but I haven't yet because I do know that if you give fossils to the villagers, they really like it, like that's their favorite gift kind of. So it's been helping me get the photos. So I haven't done that yet. Okay, so we've got some interesting things today. I don't think I have a typewriter in my um, like catalog. Also, that looks really cool. So maybe I'll buy that, but let's go and get our candy. Do I have enough space? Okay, yeah. We'll get that really quick because I always seem to forget. So we'll get that. And normally there's not really much else I ever need. Yeah, I don't really, I do like to buy, um, we'll go and get some wrapping paper because I definitely want to give some gifts to some of the villagers. We'll just get five for now. And let's go ahead and sell our seashells. So we'll sell that and all our seashells. I do need to find some more spaces for the spooky arches that I have. Um, I'm going to sell the candle too. I feel really bad, but <laughs> I don't really need it. Um, so I think that looks pretty good. And we made, let's see, 6,000? Nice. Okay, cool. And Hazel's looking around. Let's chat with her. What's up, Rutabaga? You shop here too, Jinkies? What I, what, what did I come here for again? Should have written it down. Oh well, I'll just grab whatever. Maybe that'll jog my memory. That's funny. I don't know if I have a typewriter, so I think I'll go and get this. I could always sell it back if I don't really need it, but I think it's really cute. I think it'd be cute on a little picnic area with like on a little blanket. 
Uh, but we'll head out. Okay, so here's my other little candy pile. I just keep a bunch here. We'll just drop it again. Um, so yeah, let's head out and check if we can find our fossils. Um, and different things like that and just see what the villagers are up to. Try to just kind of keep my island somewhat clean. I don't really mind if there's some extra weeds or tree branches or whatever, but definitely don't want it to get out of control. Um, as far as the spooky arches go, I'm wondering, hmm, where should we put them? Maybe we could put one right here, actually. Let's, uh, Actually, let's put one like right here. I'd like to make this kind of more of a spooky area. I think that'd be cool. Oh, definitely not what I was wanting. I kind of wanted to... might need to move some of these flowers, so let's move this guy. So I'll just move all these flowers for now um, and see if that helps. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I think it'd be fun to make this like a little spooky pathway with some decorations. Uh, let's see if we can put one on this side too. That here. Oh, it's the other way. <laughs> or no, that's right. Okay. Cute. So it's kind of like, I want this to kind of be like a spooky path. I think that'd be really cool. Um, so we'll definitely have to get some more decorations over here, but for now that's a start. Um, and then, oh, there is a fossil. We'll go and collect that. Oh, there's Lopez taking a little nap. <laughs> we'll go and head up here and collect some branches. Who's this? Eric. Oh, oh I scared his bug away. <laughs> I'm so mean. Okay, here's another fossil. So I think we've gotten three now, if I'm not, if I didn't forget. So there's three for the day. I think I still had three from yesterday. So we'll go and check up here and see if we find any more. Mm, I don't really see any more. So that's probably good. I'll probably find the other one when I'm just running around. I kind of want to add the typewriter over here though. Now that I've been passing by it, I think it might look nice over here. Um, let's see. Oh, I think that's kind of nice. Like a little area where you can read and like, you know, type up a, type up a book or something. <laughs> um, okay. How much space do I have? Okay, I have a few spots, so I think I will go ahead and take some more of these flowers. Because if I do make this a spooky area, I probably won't all the- won't- I probably won't want all of these red flowers. So I'm gonna go and take a few. That's probably good. Let's head this way. I do want to get, oh, there's Ellie. I can't remember, I, oh yeah, I do have her photo already. So we'll go ahead and get our fossils assessed. So we'll see what those are, probably give away a few of them. Awesome. Uh, that is all today. We'll go ahead and head out. But let's go ahead and sell things we don't need. So definitely these flowers, these branches, I guess the hardwood even though that's probably my least amount. I'm, I'm going to sell some of the fossils just because I really don't need that many. Um, so we'll start with that, which was quite a bit. <laughs> uh, and let's see what else we need to do. We do need to go to the Able Sisters and see what they have today, so we'll do that really quick. I still don't know what I'm going to have my character be for Halloween. I have a few ideas, but I'm not quite sure yet. I really love these striped pants. I think I already have them. Uh, maybe I'll buy one just in case. Uh, that might be all I really need today. So we'll go ahead and purchase that. Let's give away some gifts. So I can't remember, I always forget what photos I already have. I don't have Mott's, I do need to eventually get his. I don't have Hornsby's, so we'll go see what he's up to and give him a gift. Oh, and he's crafting, so that's cool. Uh, Wonder Bud, um, watch your step, okay? I'm making me a spooky scarecrow. I think I already have that, and I think they give you candy if you already have it. So I'm excited about that. I could always get more candy. 
Uh, what can I give you that's just as good? Oh, duh. How about candy? Halloween is coming up after all. Awesome. So I got another piece of candy. Let's see if we can give him a gift. I do have some fossils already wrapped from a day or two ago. So we'll give that to him. Oh, what are you giving me? Let's give him a fossil. Hopefully we can get his photo. That would be awesome. I wonder what's inside. I'm going to open it. Ooh, a copro coprolite. Wow, thank you so many bunches. Thanks, Wonderbud. Here, a white rose wall. Oh, wow, that's new. I don't think I've seen that. Oh, it's probably just the rose. Yeah, I think I think what I thought it was was something cooler than it actually is. So, I also don't have Fauna's, so she's over there tending to her flowers. So cute. Or no, she's reading a book about them. That's sweet. Okay, let's give her a picture or give her a gift. Good afternoon, oh dear. Do you want this? You want to give me something? Okay, there's one down here. Can I go and open this? Wow, you're giving me a Jer Jeremia, Maya, I don't know. What a treasure, I love fossils. Thank you so much, oh dear. Here, I want you to have my pixel shades. Aw, I want the picture. Okay. So we've got that. Also, I need to give Hazel something, but she was in the store, so okay, she is home now. So here's Hazel's house. Hers is kind of the most random, I think. <laughs> She's just got stuff all over the place and like no bed to sleep on. <laughs> okay, let's chat with her. Hazel Nuts, glad you're here. Here's a gift. Whoa, what is it, Jinkies? Give her that. Ooh, I have to see what's inside. A Demetrodon torso, ha, huh? awesome. I never thought I'd have such a rad fossil of my own, thanks. Well, one good dude deserves another. Here, have a yellow paint wall. Aw, oh, crud. I have this spooky fencing that I think I want to add to her home a little bit. Maybe we'll just replace the country fencing. Let's see what that, if that looks nice. Just for, you know, this month. Oh yeah, I think that's kind of cool. Um, so we'll replace these two, and I think that'll be good. Oh no, <laughs> I tried not to take the foosball table, but we'll go and put a few down, put her foosball table back. Awesome, let's make sure it's all... okay, perfect. So yeah, I think that's pretty good. She probably needs some more pumpkins, but for now, we'll keep it at that. Okay, who else do we need to give a gift to? We have one more. I do need to give one to Aurora, so maybe we'll head up this way and give that to her. Oh, and it's so windy, her pumpkins like swing. That's so cute. Wow. Okay. <laughs> oh no, she's sick. Ugh, watch you. Wish I thought to keep some cold medicine on hand. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's get her medicine. <laughs> oh, I feel so bad. There we go. We've got one here, we'll move to pockets. So we're back, let's give her some medicine. Sorry, just having another little dizzy spell. Um, brought her medicine. Oh, you're so thoughtful. You probably went out of your way to pick this up. I mean, a little bit, but it's okay. <laughs> oh, wow, I think this will do the trick. I think I'm going to be okay now. As thanks for your kindness, here's a magazine. Okay. Hope you don't catch what I had. Oh gosh, hopefully not. Okay, let's go ahead. Can we still give her a gift? I'm feeling much better thanks to the medicine you brought for me. I think I'll be well again in no time. Oh no, not yet. Okay. Well, crud. Um, who else? I think that might be all the people I don't have photos of. Um, other than Mott, but he's kind of stuck right now. Maybe we can decorate over here a little bit more. Let's go ahead and clear up these spots oh i just had a great idea so i know there's like a big pumpkin that diy that you get i'm assuming you get it on halloween i don't know for sure but it would be so perfect right here this big spot so i think i'm gonna go and take these down um and kind of clear this up i know there's still quite a ways till halloween uh but we'll go ahead and like decorate it a little bit in the meantime but yeah, I think that'll be nice here, this little like pumpkin area. I love that. Okay, so let's clear this up. We'll go ahead and add some of the spooky, oh, not that one, spooky fencing. Maybe just like three or four pieces. 
I'll do one more. Okay, cool. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay. I definitely think it's time to get rid of all the red flowers, or at least most of them. Oops. So we'll go and clear or fill up our inventory and sell what we can. I don't know. I think this was more of a summery area, and now that it's fall, it's kind of doesn't really match or doesn't really go with um, the rest of the island. So we got one more spot. We'll go and take this flower. We'll go ahead and make, we'll go and sell these items and then maybe I'll craft some more pumpkin DIYs real quick and place them down just for now. Okay, so yeah, I think we'll sell all this. The rest we're pretty good with. Let's um, gather some pumpkins. I know I have some inside. I guess I could get some of those, but which maybe I will do that. I do hear a balloon. We'll get that really quick. Okay, yeah, let's go get that balloon. Oh man. There we go. So let's open this. Hopefully it's something good. Knife block. It's not bad, but I know I already have some. Oh, it's a different color though. I think I've just had the wooden one. So nice to have. We'll go ahead and sell it though. But yeah, let's go craft some more pumpkin things. So we're here in my crafting room. Let's go ahead and grab some pumpkins. I know we should have some in here. Yeah, plenty. So we'll get some of these and let's see what we can craft. We've got quite a few of the spooky arches. We definitely want at least one of these scarecrows. <laughs> awesome. And I think probably one of these at least, maybe two, but we'll start with one. Also, my favorite uh, DIY from this is actually it's so hard to pick, but I do love the spooky towers. I have them all over. So we'll get one of those and let's do one of the small pumpkins too. Yeah, just one of these. So we'll start with that. We'll place it all down, see how it looks. And I can always add more eventually later on. Let's go ahead and pick up this rose bed and kick up some of these holes. We have more to work with. I also think I want to move this rock. I never really liked it there. I just kind of kept it there. But I think we should also place down, um, where is the light? Spooky lantern? No, I think it's standing lamp. So we might just move that little um, thing on the floor. But let's see. Okay, yeah. Let me pick it up. Go ahead and clear that out. Just because it doesn't really, like, it would bother me. Because <laughs> it's not, like, symmetrical. So we'll place that back, though. Let's do, I guess, maybe right there. I don't know. Um, and then for our scarecrow. Hmm. Oh, we need to move the bird back, too. I guess for now, I'm just going to start putting things down just to kind of start getting an idea of things. Oh, <laughs> kind of in my way, Eric. So we'll move that there. Okay, I think I like that there. Um, I might get another spooky lantern for like right there. But let's see, we'll go ahead and put our last little guy over here. Put this guy right here for now. And I think that's a good start. Definitely need to move some of these trees. But yeah, it's not too bad. I'll get some more to put down and maybe some different little uh, patterns on the floor. But yeah, pretty good start. I think it'll be perfect to put the pumpkin item here. Thank you guys for watching. I think I'll go and end it here for today. We'll, this will be a work in progress. We'll still work on it together. I'll get some more things built so we can have a little more options, but I think it's a good start. I like the idea a lot. I can't wait to see how it turns out. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today. I had a lot of fun just hanging out in Animal Crossing, but I will see you all very, very soon. Bye.